Hello, everybody. Welcome back to another episode of Minecraft. Today we are back on the redstone world, and I have made a double piston extender, and it's very small actually. I don't think you could make it smaller, except you have if you had some uh, ninja tricks. Um, and it's also very very fast. So let me just show you here. That's the closing, and the opening. Uh, the, op the opening can't be any faster. The closing, I don't think could be any faster because it uses a one tick pulse to get the last block down that just means that it's going down very fast only one tick and then that's one eighth of a second so now let me show you how to build it okay to build it you're gonna need, need these things three repeaters, two redstone torches two redstone dust and a lever if you want to turn it on and off by lever so that is optional Two sticky pistons, five blocks to uh, to put redstone on and so on, and a building block. I, you know, you actually only need one building block for it to work. So, no, you actually need two. Oh, there's two in the chest. So let's get on on how to build it. Okay, you're going to start with digging three blocks down and digging a three by three hole. And in the middle, you can place your two sticky pistons and the block on top. So for the input, uh, I'm using white wool. Um, so you need to put the block right here, diagonal to the pistons. Put a torch on it and put your building block right here. So as you can see, that is the double piston extension. And you can power it in two ways, either by a lever. And you need to reset it if you haven't built it finished yet but by a lever or by a redstone repeater going in like like so you can't put redstone like this and power it that would not work so double piston extension done now we just need it to retract so we put the repeater redstone dust under here repeater here two ticks and block and a torch so now this repeater will stay up a bit longer so they will both retract, retract, but this one will stay up a bit longer. So this one will retract, uh, then this one. Then we only need the block. Then we're gonna do by putting a repeater here on three ticks, sticky piston in the ground with a block above. You can also use a non-sticky piston with a sand or gravel above, just so you know. Then repeater here, pointing into the block. Um, put your block ups like this, put some redstone here and you're done. You can fill in your blocks right here and then you're done. So let me just quickly explain how it works and then it's going to be it for today. So it basically works by the trick where if whoops if you have um, torch you can power a piston like this and a torch can also power a piston like this and like this because of the block so we kind of use that because when you turn the torch on it will power this piston first which pushes, pushes this piston up to here and then it will push the block up to here so like this so that's why I could make it so small um, because of the extension it was so small so basically let me just quickly show you when you have this setup and two pistons which are both both extended we're just waiting I'm waiting to explain why the block, how the block is retracted. As you can see, when I flick this lever off, they, they both extract at the same time. So if this one was a bit longer to extract, it would be like this. And the block would be right here. So then we just needed this piston to fire. And that's how we get the block to here. 
So that's basically what's working here. So when I flick this lever, you know, flick it up, it will extend, and when I flick it down, the first thing will happen happen is this torch turns on, which means these pistons will extract as they are right here. So we have the problem as over here. The next thing that's going to happen is this repeater is going to turn on, allowing this torch to turn off. So now when they're both in the air, this one will pull this piston down. So now they are in this position. Then we just need the block. So the block goes down to a um, four tick delay, three on this repeater, one on this, so it's four ticks. Then goes into this redstone dust, which powers this block, and and it's just to the side of this piston. So this piston will grab the block, and then you have your extraction. So. Um, that's it for today guys, thank you for watching, please comment, rate and subscribe, and check out my other videos, so uh, bye.